Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. If you're from an English speaking country. <laughs> so um We just woke up literally. Yeah. We had quite a, yeah, we had quite a hard time to wake up. <laughs> no, this is kind of English. <laughs> <laughs> So we, uh, we assumed that the painters were going to come on Monday because they said they were going to come on Friday. Um, but then someone else said that there was the week starting this week. So <clears throat> Early in the morning, but no one could tell us the time. Well, yeah, we still time. haven't received an email about what's going on. We so. haven't received an answer. So, yeah. Woke up nice and early. Super nice and early. I just started some meditation. I just then, started my coffee. <laughs> and then Sarah was like, oh, should we vlog today? I was like, oh, cool. Yeah, so we don't really know what we are up to today. So let's see how it goes. We really hope the painters are coming. Because otherwise we are waking up every day super early. And no one, no one is coming. <laughs> <laughs> we look so tired. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I make my coffee. You can meditate. And now we start slowly in the day. Juicy. Ciao. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? So, what I'm doing without my coffee machine is um, I'm making my coffee with this espresso, whatever it is. I accidentally washed that in the dishwasher, with, uh, which was a huge mistake. But actually... <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Because it looks so sharp right now. <laughs> it really looks very fucked up. Um, yeah, shit. But um, it's such a good coffee. Um, I think it's a bit too strong for Thomas. <laughs> but I really like it. And then uh, we already had in the flat from Nespresso. Yeah, this uh, milk, milk maker. <laughs> milk, uh, milk, milk making froth, machine. Milk thruster. Milk thruster. <laughs> <laughs> the milk thruster. <laughs> this is really what, what you say in English. Um, Aufschäumer in Deutsch. <laughs> Milch Aufschäumer in German. And, um, and <laughs> I'm doing my oatly oat milk now. A bit foamy, so I have a nice and lecker cappuccino. <laughs> throughout the day uh, seems to help with my candida SIBO symptoms <coughs> so this is my breakfast we got some bananas and we got some dates um, me and Sarah might be going to the gym in about an hour so oh really yeah why not okay so this is a good uh, pre-workout dates provide a lot of energy fiber carbohydrates vitamins and then also the bananas potassium and amino acids um, so yeah, this is my breakfast. So then, was my breakfast also a good, good thing before the gym? It was okay, <laughs> but it was more like of a good tasting thing than actual nutrition, but it's all right. So this is not like an advertisement or anything. I'm not sponsored by these uh, companies, but <clears throat> just wanted to share with you guys that these really helped me. So digestive enzymes, um, and you take these before you start eating. Um, and if you have some sort of issue with your digestion or your gut, then these can really help because um, enzymes are really key in breaking down the food when it goes through your stomach and into your small intestine. Um, so I have a big problem with digesting my food. My food kind of gets stuck in my gut and then that's why there's bacterial overgrowth inside. Um, so these are doctor's best digestive enzymes. They have all kinds of enzymes that break down fats, carbohydrates, proteins. These are some other ones that are much cheaper that I decided to um, try recently. Um, Puritan's Pride. Super strength multi-enzyme formula. Um, so yeah, you just pop two of these before you start eating. 
um, and then it helps you digest food better. So we are getting ready for gym now. We have to book time slots. So we have our app for our gym and we have to put the time in where we would like to come. We also have to write down how long we are going to be there because of the um, corona situation, which is quite good. It's still quite busy there, but it's all right. And um, I'm actually not the biggest fan of going to the gym, but yeah, I would only go with Thomas together. And um, today, I think we are, what are we going to do today in the gym? Uh, we're doing a full body session. Full body session. We're going to do squats, squats. we're going to do deadlifts, deadlifts. we're going to do some pull-ups again. Yeah, not me Because Sarah was like super sore. Oh my god, I was so arms. sore. It's like still sore. Four, five days? Five days already. I did pull-ups with Thomas' help. And yeah, you guys might have seen in the story, but I was assisting her on the pull-ups. Yeah. Since she was pulling herself up like this. But I wasn't able to straight my, straight my arm for like five days. Yeah. It's still sore. Um, and then we're going to do some pressing, some bench press. So, so yeah, yeah, full body session. Just get ready. I recognize the powers as they ready. Call the names, I'll break them one by one and dance to be. Was it good? The, it was quite an days. easy workout, like, wasn't um, that difficult? But we're building up in weight slowly because we're learning. Well, Sarah's learning the technique, and um, I'm bu building up slowly with my squats as well. So I'm careful with the knees. Um, yeah, it was a good one, right? Good one, yes. So we just got back from the gym. We had to wait quite a while for this Vapiano, Vapiano. but it looks quite lecker. So hopefully, it's worth the wait. Hopefully, this pasta is good for the gut, maybe not but we'll see how it goes. Should be fine after the gym. That one's mine. This one's Sarah's, and we're about to watch some Arrow. So we started watching Arrow again, didn't we? Yes, just Stephen Amell is just my favorite. Hey. I was just joking. Arrow is a good series. Yeah, better be. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Just joking. So Sarah's making some nice Broccoli and potato soup. Yes, it's actually the third time in a row. In a, in a row. Yes. <laughs> We're eating soup. It's getting quite cold here in the Netherlands, isn't it, Sarah? Yeah, super cold. Um, at first we ate pumpkin soup. We made the pumpkin soup two, three times, I think. Yeah, we had, it we had it two days in a row. Two days. Um, then we had potato soup and now we're making... Broccoli. Broccoli soup. And um, I'm going to have some rice again. So cook that separately. British style, well, Thomas style, and what, what are you gonna have? You're gonna have I'm anything gonna with have, it? Toast? I'm, I'm gonna have just. <laughs> gonna. I'm gonna have just the broccoli soup. With the toasty bits on the top? No, or? probably not. Just the soup. I'm not that hungry actually. Okay. And I, I, had, a, I had a huge um, Zoom call with Patty and Lisa. Oh yeah? For like two and a half hours. And we actually planned a project. Cool. Yes. Sounds good. Sounds good. So we'll let you guys know what it looks like at the end. Um, but you pretty much chop some onions, put it in a nice big uh, saucepan like this with some butter or olive oil, and um, cook them for a bit. And then you can chop up the broccoli. Um, we've got broccoli potatoes. Chop them up, put them in there. Then put some water in there. And then we've got some vegetable broth. brothy 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 brothy. So that will go in there as well. And normally garlic um, goes in there as well, but because of Thomas Sibo, we can't... Um, same story, right? Yeah, same story. Same story, no over and over again. So no garlic. So 20 Maybe. minutes it takes, and then we kind of smash, well, how do you say? Yeah, you 
like uh, it's like a whisk I don't know electric see. food mixer yes. goes, zzz, 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 and zzz, zzz, zzz. whisks it all up yes 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 <laughs> and then I really feel like watching Harry Potter tonight yeah we how, actually, how do you feel about that definitely I love Harry Potter but who doesn't and I think Amsterdam actually looks a bit like um, Harry Potter. It does, on some of the streets. Yes, and uh, we kind of walked um, to our um, gym today, and especially this street looks like the Winkelgasse. I don't know how you say it in German uh, in English, the street. Yeah, where they buy the wands and stuff. Yes, like Winkelgasse. We'll see that if we watch the first one. Ah, yes, yes, in English. I haven't watched Harry Potter in English yet. Oh, that'd be good then. Yes. It's the original language. You yes. can actually watch it for Harry real. Harry Potter. For real this time. Harry Potter and Hermione. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you doing here, my love? Um, ich mach's klein. Blending the soup. Yeah. Zauberstab, we call that. Zauberstab? I don't know in English actually, but it's exactly what Harry Potter is having, like every... A wand? Yeah, that's what we call this. Oh. A soup wand. <laughs> and then um, I'm going to mix mine with rice. And Sarah's probably going to have some toast on the top. Oh yeah, ignore the mess by the way guys. It's Sarah, it's not me. So we're going to show you what it looks like in about five minutes. We have some soupy. So this is Sarah's with some asparagus and some, what is that? Pita seal, whatever that is. And I've got some rice mixed in with their alfalfa pita seal. Oh, this is so messy, guys. Hope you don't mind. Um, going to have some seeds as well. Shatsi. This is literally only broccoli. Only broccoli, two uh, potatoes and... Potatoes? Pot I'm an arrow mood, yeah. Oh no, three potatoes. 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 Yeah, and some um, broth. And three onions. And water and broth, yeah. Yeah. That can happen. So guys, we are back on the sofa where the vlog started. And um, we finished dinner, we're just sipping some tea. And also, we had this tea in... Uh, well, I had this tea in the, in the morning as yeah, well. Yeah, did you? <laughs> Funny. Anyway, so we're going to watch Harry Potter right now. And um, just wanted to say good night, pretty much. Good night. Yes. It's what's the time? It's like 9? It's late. Think? No, it's 10 p.m. I think already. Uh, okay. We have to wake up early tomorrow because we've got an email saying that the painters are definitely going to come tomorrow. So. But the funny thing is our neighbor sent us this email to inform us, yes? Not our landlords. Yeah. Just saying. Just saying, hashtag. Hashtag. <laughs> Living with Dutch people be like. <laughs> <laughs> Just joking. <laughs> um, yes. I uh, hope you enjoyed the vlog and um, we'll see you soon. Yes, and you can also write down in the comments which kind of videos you would like to see from yeah. us. So we could. Yeah, if you like the gym video, then we could do some more of those. Yeah, as well. I'm pretty sure because you know Thomas is a personal trainer and. He could definitely explain some shit. Some shit? Some shit, some stuff for a video if you're interested in yeah. how to squat or something. How to yeah, build well, a I'm booty. teaching Sarah how to properly squat because she has really bad knee problems. Really bad knee problems. Uh, but your knee isn't hurting with training with me, right? No, that's crazy. It's literally the first time in my life where my knee really doesn't hurt. So, yes. yeah. We're going to be on doing some training three <laughs> times a week, um, getting strong on the squats, the deadlifts, and Sarah's also doing some uh, upper body stuff. With yeah, me my, well. my arm is already <laughs> wobbly <laughs> holding the camera, to be <laughs> honest. So, good night, guys, and see you on the next video. Yeah.